Welcome to the NC Spin After Spin. Additional comments from our panelists just available on our website. Uh, Rick Henderson, I want to ask you, what do you wish you had said on last week's show, but you didn't? When we were talking about the debate between ECU Viden and UNC Healthcare about uh, the fate of uh, Brody Medical School and the like, one thing that I wish that I had a chance to say was that when all is said and done, when the debates about the board and the governance and everything is over with, probably looks like we're going to go back to the status quo ante. We're going to have a situation in which we have uh, ele you know, 11 people appointed by uh, the folks in Greenville and nine people appointed by the Board of Governors on that board. It's going in to the same manner. In the same manner. And it's, what it will do, it will only have stirred up lots of bad blood and cost lots of money. I was just getting ready to say, so what we've done is we've created this uproar. Right. And then we're going to return back to the status quo. It's going to return back to the status quo, and it's going to be costing tens of thousands of dollars of, of law lawyer fees, which are coming out of North Carolina's taxpayers, by the way. When will we ever learn? Never. Never. <laughs> <laughs> well, thanks for watching the After Spin. We'll have more video all during the week on ncspin.com.